What if I told you that true wholeness requires nothing less than your entire being? Dive into Carl Jung's powerful wisdom and discover how to live a life without compromise. Carl Jung, the great Swiss psychoanalyst, once wrote, Wholeness is not achieved by cutting off a portion of one's being, but by integration of the shadow. To be whole, we must integrate all aspects of ourselves, even the dark parts. Jung believed within us exists a vast inner world of conscious and unconscious drives. True wholeness is achieved when we confront and accept our entire being. We will delve into the unconscious, confront our shadows and emerge transformed. Self-reflection is essential for self-understanding and personal growth. Without it, we are like ships adrift at sea, tossed by unconscious impulses. Self-reflection anchors us, providing stability to navigate complexities. To understand yourself, confront the hidden parts of your being. Set aside time each day for quiet reflection. Mindfulness, the practice of paying attention to the present moment without judgment, is essential for self-awareness and reducing stress. In a world full of distractions, it's easy to get caught up in the past or future. Mindfulness brings us back to the present, where life truly happens. When mindful, we are fully present. Senses heightened, minds quiet. Benefits include reduced stress, improved focus and enhanced compassion. Start by focusing on your breath and engaging your senses in daily activities. With mindfulness, you'll better manage stress and appreciate the present moment. Authenticity, the quality of being true to oneself, is essential for a fulfilling life. It means living in alignment with our values and desires. Authenticity requires courage and letting go of external validation. The rewards far outweigh the risks. True to ourselves, we find inner peace and freedom and Setting boundaries is an act of self-care, a way of protecting your time, energy and emotional well-being. Boundaries are not about being selfish, but about creating healthy limits in our relationships and lives. When we lack boundaries, we allow others to dictate our time and energy, leading to burnout and resentment. Setting boundaries allows us to conserve our energy for the things that truly matter to us. Identify your limits and communicate them clearly and respectfully. Don't be afraid to say no to requests that drain your energy or compromise your values. Remember, setting boundaries is about taking control of your own life. Passion is the driving force that propels us forward. The fuel that ignites our souls and gives our lives meaning. When we are disconnected from our passions, life can feel dull and meaningless. Reconnecting with our passions infuses our lives with energy and enthusiasm. Identifying your passions requires introspection and a willingness to explore your interests. Once you have identified your passions, make time for them in your life, even if it is just for a few minutes each day. Don't be afraid to experiment and follow your curiosity. The more you engage in activities that light you up, the more fulfilled your life will become. Humans are social creatures, wired for connection and belonging. The quality of our relationships has a profound impact on our overall well-being. Healthy relationships provide us with love, support and a sense of belonging. Toxic relationships, on the other hand, can drain our energy and erode our self-esteem. Cultivating healthy relationships requires effort and intention. Surround yourself with supportive, respectful and uplifting people. Communicate honestly and openly and practice empathy and understanding. Continuous learning, the ongoing pursuit of knowledge and skills, is essential for growth. In a constantly changing world, adaptability and willingness to learn are key. Stay ahead and thrive in a dynamic job market. 
lifelong learning benefits extend beyond the professional realm. It keeps our minds engaged and reduces cognitive decline. Our physical health is intricately interconnected with our mental, emotional and spiritual well-being. When we neglect our physical health, it affects every other aspect of our lives. Regular exercise strengthens our bodies, improves cardiovascular health and boosts our immune systems. A balanced and nutritious diet provides our bodies with essential vitamins and nutrients. Adequate sleep allows our bodies to rest, repair and rejuvenate. Make time for regular exercise, nourish your body with whole foods and prioritize sleep. When we prioritize our physical health, we create a ripple effect, positively impacting our overall well-being. Just as we prioritize our physical health, it is essential that we prioritize our mental health as well. Mental health is a state of well-being in which we realize our full potential. Break down barriers and create a culture where it is acceptable to talk about mental health. Know that you are not alone and seeking help is a sign of strength. Engage in activities that bring you joy and practice mindfulness. Gratitude, the act of appreciating the good things in our lives, has numerous benefits for our well-being. When we focus on what we are grateful for, we open ourselves up to experiencing more joy and contentment. Gratitude has been linked to increased happiness, improved relationships and reduced stress. Start each day by reflecting on three things you are grateful for. Keep a gratitude journal and express your gratitude to others. The more you practice gratitude, the more you will find to be grateful for. Gratitude is about choosing to focus on the good, even in the midst of difficulties. Life is a complex tapestry woven together from countless threads. Work, relationships, health, personal growth and more. Finding balance is essential for our overall well-being. When one area of our life becomes overly dominant, it can throw the entire system out of balance. Finding balance is about being attuned to our own needs and making adjustments as needed. Regularly assess your life, identifying areas where you might be out of balance. Set boundaries between work and personal life and make time for activities that bring you joy. Don't be afraid to delegate tasks or ask for help when needed. Courage is not the absence of fear, but the willingness to act in spite of fear. Fear is a natural human emotion, signalling that we are about to step outside of our comfort zones. When we allow fear to dictate our choices, we limit our potential for growth. Facing our fears head-on reveals a strength and resilience we never knew we possessed. Start by identifying something you have been avoiding out of fear. Break it down into smaller manageable steps and take action. Celebrate your successes along the way, no matter how small they may seem. The search for purpose is a journey unique to each individual. It is a process of exploration, self-discovery and aligning your actions with your values and passions. When we live a life aligned with our purpose, we experience deep fulfillment and satisfaction. Reflect on your values, passions and unique skills. What are you naturally drawn to? What problems do you feel compelled to solve? Don't be afraid to experiment and follow your curiosity. Your purpose may evolve over time and that is okay. Integrity is the quality of being honest and having strong moral principles. It is about living in alignment with our values, even when it is difficult. Living with integrity is essential for building trust, both with ourselves and others. When our actions match our values, we create a solid foundation for authentic relationships. Integrity is a lifelong practice, 
a commitment to living in accordance with our higher selves. Reflect on your past behavior, identifying areas where you may have strayed from your values. Make amends where necessary and commit to making choices aligned with your values. Compassion is the ability to understand and share the feelings of others. It is the quality of being kind and forgiving, both to ourselves and others. When we cultivate compassion, we open ourselves up to experiencing greater peace and connection. Start by practicing self-compassion and treating yourself with kindness. Notice when you are being self-critical and challenge those negative thoughts. Extend that same compassion outwards to others and practice empathy. Look for opportunities to perform acts of kindness, no matter how small. Life is full of challenges, obstacles and setbacks. Resilience is the ability to bounce back from adversity and adapt to change. It is the inner strength that allows us to weather life's storms and emerge stronger. Resilience is built through facing our fears, overcoming challenges and learning from our mistakes. Cultivate a growth mindset, believing that you can learn and grow from anything life throws your way. Develop strong coping mechanisms for dealing with stress and build a strong support system. Remember that setbacks are a natural part of life and offer opportunities for growth. Creativity is an innate human capacity, a way of expressing ourselves and exploring our inner worlds. Engaging in creative activities has numerous benefits for our well-being. It can reduce stress, boost our moods, and enhance our overall sense of well-being. Make time for creativity in your life, even if it is just for a few minutes each day. Explore different art forms and experiment with new materials. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. The more you create, the more you will tap into your unique wellspring of creative potential. In a world that is increasingly complex, the pursuit of simplicity can be a radical act. Simplicity is about making conscious choices about what we allow into our lives. It is about letting go of the non-essential to focus on what truly matters. When we simplify our lives, we create space for joy, love and activities that nourish our souls. Start by decluttering your physical space and simplifying your commitments create a minimalist living space that is calming and inviting. By simplifying our lives, we create space for what truly matters. In today's fast-paced world, it is easy to become disconnected from nature. But as human beings, we are inherently connected to nature, and spending time in nature has numerous benefits. Studies show that spending time in nature can reduce stress, improve mood, and boost creativity. Being in nature allows us to slow down and reconnect with our senses. Make time for nature in your daily life, even if it is just for a few minutes. Take a walk in the park, sit by a lake, or go for a hike in the woods. Pay attention to the sights, sounds and smells of nature. Service to others, the act of giving back to our communities is essential for living a meaningful life. When we focus on something larger than ourselves, we experience a sense of purpose and fulfillment. Acts of service do not have to be grand or heroic. Identify a cause that you are passionate about and find ways to get involved. Volunteer your time, donate your resources, or spread awareness about the cause. The more you give, the more you will receive in return. Service to others is a privilege and an opportunity to make a positive impact on the world. As we conclude our journey into Carl Jung's teachings, remember the path to wholeness is ongoing. Embrace all aspects of yourself into a unified whole. Cultivate self-awareness, practice mindfulness, and nurture relationships. Create conditions for wholeness to emerge. This journey requires courage and commitment. Subscribe for more insights on your journey.